Zambra. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video and deciding to watch with me. Today we are starting the long awaited reactions to season five, A Miraculous Ladybug. I am so excited for this. Um, the hype around like season four, season five was like kind of around when I started kind of doing these originally. Season four was going strong. So I've heard a lot of like, you know, mixed feelings and such for season five. So I'm excited to finally like start understanding what all the like panic and like freaking out was from the fandom. So I am hyped for this. I hope you guys are as well. We are going to be watching season five, episode one evolution, which we have a lot going on because basically Marinette lost all the miraculous. All of the miraculous are basically gone. So we're going to have to do something and something fast because one of the ones that he has is Bubex's, the time travel one, which I can't imagine Gabriel Gress having that. And he's not going to be like, LOL, like not going to use this one. Like he going to use it right away. So I'm nervous. Things are going to get timey wimey. It's going to be crazy. So buckle in and keep in mind if you want to see the next reactions early or just hear, see my full reactions to Miraculous Ladybug, you can support me over on my Patreon page. Link down in the description below. But without further ado, let's get started. Oh my God. In the daytime, I'm Marinette. What I is this opening? So, oh, that didn't look good. Oh, that's cool though. Um, he's really blinging out. Oh, we are starting right where we left off. Oh, okay. Help Moth, Shadow Moth, or Monarch, whatever your name is. Hawk Daddy's my personal favorite. We won't stop fighting until we've got every single one of the others back. <laughs> It's exactly what I've wanted for months. All I need now are the Ladybug and the Cat Miraculous. Once I get them, I'll combine the two and fulfill the magic wish that will bring you back to me. Can you look at the rooster one? Look, look how mad it looks. It's shaking, but it's like, I hate you. You are no my prisoners. You are my slaves and I am oh. your master. Do you understand, you stupid creatures? Why are you so mean? Can you not be compassionate? Ladybug has finally faulted, taking risks and paid off. I have nearly all of the miraculous, including the one of evolution, granting the power of time. Oh, so. no. Gabriel, wait for me. As soon as I'm home, we'll- No! Patience, don't do anything stupid. Nuru, fuck dual metamorphosis. Oh, oh no. The pattern on his, life. like, coat now. <sighs> oh, hi. He's getting tired. This is our chance. I watch. We've got to get the rapid miraculous back. <laughs> What's that? How can you know it? Hey! Why couldn't you come sooner? As you know, changing the past can have serious consequences on the present. Ha! Uh -huh. It's time to rewrite history! Oh my god, I'm so scared. Oh no. Fascinating. I can't imagine this is easy to use. Oh, <laughs> Lady Wi-Fi! <laughs> With a few new miraculous, but yes, it is me. Hello, Lady uh -oh. <laughs> Okay, but this would have been kind of cool if we could see some of this stuff during this season. Fast, your crush will soon be slapped. <laughs> oh. oh. Lady Buck, that was easy. You follow me through time. I'm the one with the rapid miraculous. Amateur. Oh, well, oh, no. You might still be their guardian, Ladybug. Rapid. But I'm their master now. Grab them. Oh. Oh. Uh oh no, that's so bad for us. Um, we have no idea if he starts entering the burrows. We don't know which one is him. Oh no! Shelter. Oh, this is bad. Thank you. Can we 
grab some of the miraculous off this man? Grab the miraculous! Oh. Why can't we just grab them? If you can touch him with your stick, you can yoink them off. Attention, lady! Only the holder of the rocket miraculous can open a time portal. Hmm. You do it, Kitty. You want oh. me to control time? It's you and me, remember? Aww, I like that. That's cute. Flag? Look, you the fuck. What does it look like? I'm actually so jazzed. Ooh! Oh, the blue looks so good on you, Kitty! I love it! Let's take a short time. She's the one who will be in for a surprise. Wow, you are surprisingly very savvy at using this miraculous already. I get he understands how miraculous works, so it's probably easier. But it's kind of crazy. Oh, they could have been so bad. So, who's chasing you now? What do you think? Huh? Well, Very quick. Aww. Yeah. This is kind of fun to see things from different angles. Getting to this is our chief. So watch, we've got to get the record director as well. Oh, it's this moment again. When am I? So much red turtle be in, I'm not sure what else. Mm -hmm. Are you lost? It's over. Give us back the miraculous. <sighs> Nuru, fuck, ways, tricks, pull it. We'll be here a while, Mohan. <laughs> and if you take it back, I'll always find uh... it. Oh. Did you know using too many miraculous at once is dangerous? <sighs> Well, yoink him off of him. Yoink them off of him and honestly just chuck him in the river. Take it. <laughs> and then take the do dog one. Come on, oh. we must get the boss. Master Fu? Oh. Fetch. Uh. <gasps> Again, we knew this was gonna happen, girlfriend. Like, why didn't we grab the dog one? Now that he's touched the rabbit miraculous with the ball of the dog, he's created a magical link between them. All you have to do is just grab the dog one! You grab them both. It's just that simple. A mini miracle box? Uh... I got the same one to defeat Monarch when he was still hot mom back on Hero's Day. But I don't know how we can use it here and now. <gasps> oh, Master! Literally, we just saw Master! Master Fu! Oh, we are severely course, messing with the time. Of course, the ticket. It's not happening here or now. Oh gosh. Clemmies, what's happening? I don't need to answer me. Clemmies need to be fed. Without food, we become weak, and so do your hours. I know, but I have nothing for you. I am your master. What will you learn? That your actions have consequences. Gabriel? Find food for these useless creatures. Okay, so at some point people knew about Miraculous, so I'm very confused why we don't know about them anymore and not being chased. Master Fu, we need a Miraculous! How do you know my name? Who gave you your jewels? You did. We meet and become friends in the future. You live in fear because of the mistakes you've made in the past, but one day you'll find peace. Hmm? I believe you. Wow. So quickly. Such powers are meant to serve oh, so the we, greater we're good. Still missing. You must never fall into, into the wrong hands. Hmm? The peacock and the has not to disturb the river of time. Blood. You must return it to me moth, once whatever. the mission is over. That's interesting. So he's met us before. That's cool. So what was the important thing you needed to show me, Dad? Uh, is it finally your time, baby? Maybe I'll be the scientist who invents the time machine. And I'll Aww. take you to see these moments in person. <laughs> Cute. I'd love that. Why are you looking at me like that? To remember you, then this moment, here, then now. It is time! Here is the Miraculous of the Dog. Ah! Wait, I thought... The Dog Miraculous? Wasn't my thing time travel? Monarch has stolen the Miraculous of the Rabbit. We oh. need your help to get it back. But oh. I don't know why is a rabbit? Um, <laughs> it's complicated. Okay, I mean, fair. I, I I guess I didn't realize which one we grabbed. The Miraculous of Time, you won't return it to me. You'll have to continue wearing it in order to protect it until Monarch is defeated. Oh. But that means you won't be able to return to this time right away. You knew it. You wrote to me from all the eras you visited, so I wouldn't oh. worry about you. Oh, that's so cool. <laughs> okay, but like, LOL, isn't that like super dangerous for like the time continuum as someone who's supposed to be protecting it? I'll be back but it's soon. Cute. Okay, like it's I'm cute. Don't get me wrong. Like... Back on the hunt. Back on the hunt. Okay, 
Okay, let's see you. Canine girl, rip! Aw, you're cute, canine girl. I like that. Aww. See you soon, honey. <laughs> okay, but like, she looks so cute. Don't worry, my superpower will repair every- Oh <laughs> yeah, don't, don't, don't look at that. Just keep a blind eye. So, first, with your ball, you've got to touch the rabbit miraculous that monarch stole. I'm guessing you can't notice anything? <laughs> Wouldn't it just be easier for us to go here and- Mission accomplished. Just grab the dog one from him? And to make sure that he falls for it, we're gonna leave him a little gift. Here. <laughs> Oh my gosh, so we're going back to season three finale now. All right. My brain's hurting a bit, but I'm following well enough. There is another way to use the Miraculous of the Rabbit. You could go back to a time before Emily used the damaged Peacock Miraculous. You can save your wife, Gabriel. Oh. This holds the information on how to repair the magic jewel so that Emily never becomes ill using it. You would just need to give the drive to yourself. Oh. Make the right choice. It's not too late. Oh. I mean, How did I not think of that? That, it wouldn't be that bad, right? Because then he would never do this stuff. So isn't, maybe we should let him, right? Right? Isn't that the better solution for everybody? He just goes and saves his wife? And then we never have? <gasps> oh, Hawk Moth. For you. Are you sure you're ready? Yes. Oh, she's so pretty. Much prettier than those weird photos that we see of her all the time. <sighs> what are you do what are whoa. <laughs> what are y'all doing with the with the peacock miraculous? What are y'all doing with it? That was an odd motion. Lady Duck, you're trying to trick me again? <sighs> Why are you hesitating? Just I guess the timeline right would be different. Love, I promise. Why is he so gung-ho on like defeating these children when he can just save his wife? That's the only reason why he's doing this is to save his wife. Dark. Oh, oh, I don't really love the blue brown, but it's so cute. Oh. Oh, interesting. You lost as usual. <laughs> okay, but can we try to get some of the miraculous back? Miraculous ladybug. Wait, we're just leaving him with all the other ones, though. Like it's still dangerous. Oh, it was enough for what? Let's hit. Did I just speak backwards? Yep, that's what happens when you mess with the time continuum. <laughs> oh, I knew you, Rocket. <laughs> Aww. The time has come. <laughs> Ready for a long journey, figures? Uh, I'm having a serious case of deja vu, right? Fluff? Cool fluff. Aww, so wait. Will Alex not be at school anymore? Or will Alex be at school? Is she like gone, gone now, technically? Doing her duties? Oh, I'm so curious. I want to know. Also, I love the Bunny Miraculous. It's so cute. Can I see them side by side? They're they're slightly different. They're not identical outfits. Back in less than a second. Cute. <laughs> we're starting our selfies. You were wrong to leave me here, lady. For the future yeah, belongs to those who live in the past. Here? I don't need the rabbit miraculous. I'm going to relive everything we've been through, and thanks to my miraculous, I will defeat you. Sorry, Mafi. Not this time either. Oh, okay, good. I was gonna say, I was like, this seems problematic. Right on time for you. Oh. Easy. Can we get them? Can we get a few back, please? You will never take a miraculous from the ever again. Time is running out for both of you now. Nuru, Bark, Long, Unify. Why can't we take them off? Okay, bye. I feel like we've had the opportunity to take it off of him. I could have changed everything. Emily, my love, can you ever forgive me? You did kind of make a. Rather Gabriel, selfish did it work? Lady Bug tricked me. She, she stole the Time Miraculous from me. <laughs> Lady Bug can't get away with this. You had the Time Miraculous. You could have chosen to save Emily. You could have chosen to save me. 
But instead, you chose your obsession with Ladybug and Cadmore. Oh! You're insane, Gabriel. <gasps> it's not my fault. Natalie! It was Ladybug. <laughs> you don't deserve my help. You don't deserve anyone's help. Oh my gosh! Yes, Queen, slay! Slay! Slay your enemies! Raise up your army! Take your rightful place upon the throne! Wow! Natalie just told you off! Good for her! Oh my god! Oh my god! Natalie! Girl, get it! I'm so proud of her. Okay, um, honestly, a crazy episode, but I followed it pretty well. It wasn't as confusing as some of the other time ones, but I cannot stress enough how proud I am of Natalie. Oh my god, girl can get it. I love her. I have so much more respect for her because, like, I thought she was just gonna blindly keep going along with him. Um, you know, just being like, yeah, whatever, blah, 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 blah. And like being like, I want Emily back, but I also really want to, mm -hmm, your man too, Emily. Kind of got a crush on him. So seeing her like be like, here you go. Here is the drive. I have it ready for you. All you have to do is just give it to yourself. It'll give you the instructions you need to fix the Peacock Miraculous so this never happened to Emily, aka so that this never happened to Natalie as well. And the dude literally didn't do it. He literally was like, Ugh. like his hand was in there. All you had to do was just drop it. But he's like, LOL, I have loved tormenting these children for like a year. LOL, it's been so much fun, like getting to like hurt people and like be an asshole to my son. And like, I love bullying these two like, 15 year old children every day. It's been the highlight of my year. I don't want this to end. <laughs> That's literally what Monarch just did. That is what Hawk Daddy did. He literally is just like, LOL, I love bullying 15 year old children. <laughs> I, I fucking love this show, man. <laughs> I fucking love it. It's so funny. This man, he's trying to help his wife, who I, at this point, I think she used the peacock, the broken peacock miraculous to make Adrian and Felix. In some way, they are senti monsters, is my thought. Um, I don't know if she just made a senti embryo and had baby or what happened with it, but she did. And like, he literally, okay, like, hear me out though. Hear me out though. And it's further confirmed. It, it, this episode confirmed it even more that I think it is. She made herself like a scenty womb or something. Something weird happened there. Cause literally they're having a date and he showed her like the Peacock Miraculous. He's like, do you think you're ready? And she's like, <laughs> yes, I am. And he like princess picked her up and he's like, let's go, mm -mm -mm, you know, like, the kind of like pickup you do when you're like, let's go, my wife. Let's let's have fun. <laughs> and like after giving that to her. So I think they did some weird sexy business with the peacock miraculous. The broken peacock miraculous. Some sexy business went on. <laughs> and then out came Adrian. <laughs> And instead of helping his wife, who is in a comatose state, okay, she is in a comatose state, instead of helping her and his assistant, who is in love with him and doing everything because she is in love with Emily and him, instead of helping these women in this life that he is hurt, he's like, LOL. Actually, I don't want the timeline to change. I don't want my life to be different because I really love tormenting 15-year-old children. I have found out tormenting 15-year-old children is my kink. <laughs> that's, that's what he chose. That's what he chose today is to bully 15-year-old children for the rest of his life and set, for the, the year that she's been gone. And who knows? Well, she didn't. 
I don't, uh, he was like way younger. So like, I don't think they had Adrian yet is my guess. Cause I, I do believe they used, he was like, are you ready? And he gave her the peacock miraculous. So I, if, if it's true that Adrian is like a senti being, then I think that was like, you know, before Adrian was born. So he's like, LOL. I, I have loved this one year of bullying these like 15 year old children so much that I will give up on the potential of having a really nice, enjoyable, peaceful life with my alive wife, not broken, uh, <laughs> not broken assistant and my soon to be child. Like he would get to experience his son's birth again, you know, like really beautiful moments that people wish they could go back for. Like he would give that all up just to bully two 15 year olds. <laughs> like I can't, I cannot. There is no sense and I get it. Like I think Natalie should have been more mad. Actually, you know what? I don't even think Natalie was mad enough. She, she could have been more mad. Like girls, like what is wrong with you? Like you could have had everything you wanted right here, right now, but instead you'd rather bully two 15 year old children <laughs> and keep me broken. She's like, I am dying. Your wife has basically been dead for like a hundred weeks. Like, and instead you're like, LOL, let's bully children. I, I'm so, I can't even, I can't, my, my head cannot wrap around anything else because of the absolute ridiculousness of this first episode of season five. I'm going to have a mental breakdown. My, I'm going to end up dying. I don't know. I'm a, I'm gonna go to the shadow realm by the end of this season. I, I am dead set on that. There, this is so ridiculous and I love it. I love it. I'm not, I'm not trashing the show. I am not trashing the show. I assure you I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I'm having the best time ever. <laughs> but okay. Okay. I will get off. I will, I will get off of it. But can we all just confirm Monarch found out, found out today that he has a new kink and it's bullying children. Okay. Let's, we're all on the same page with that. Cool. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> so moving on to like the things I should be actually talking about. Alex has the uh, bunny miraculous, a uh, rabbit miraculous, bunny rabbit, whatever. Um, I love it. I'm so glad that we finally got that moment. I was kind of wondering. I thought maybe we would get that at the end of season four, but it makes sense. We are using it basically the same day. I thought we were going to use it then. But I'm glad that she now has it. Um, I think it's cool. And I like that we also got to find out that dad knows about the miraculous more. Because he kind of like seemed like he might be knowledgeable about them a bit. Or at least of the uh, the rabbit. So I like the fact that we found out that basically she's been sending her dad photos of all the times that she's been through and getting to experience and share them with him, which I think is very adorable. And I love that. He's just like, totally like, yep, this is your destiny. And I will remember this moment forever. Cause this will be one of the last times I really get to see you. So it was really cute. And I sincerely enjoyed that part. I think it was really well done. Um, I was surprised though that they also gave Alex the dog miraculous. I was a little bit shocked. I didn't think Alex was going to get a different miraculous ever, but I kind of like it. It's cute. The dog one's cute. Um, God, we have seen so many people with the dog miraculous though. I'm just kind of realizing that, uh, is, um, I think it's, is it currently tied with, uh, yeah, it's moderately tied with the cat and ladybug miraculous for most time for most individuals using it that we've seen. Obviously, ladybugs is still the most because we know there's been previous ladybugs. But from what we've seen, because we've had Felix use the dog, we've had uh oh my god, I'm forgetting her name, Chloe's friend. Um, oh my god, I can't remember her name. 
something with an S, Sophie, so, 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 so. I don't remember her name, but the, her, closet girl. <laughs> and then Alex. So it's interesting to see Bart kind of be used. Um, I really love the, uh, the Bonnie Miraculous design. I think it's super cute. I love the outfit so much. Uh, I think it's slowly growing on me more. Maybe it's because I've been dyeing my hair blue more, so I'm really liking the blue colors, maybe. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's my my idea. So I, I generally enjoy it. I'm glad uh, Alex has it. And it's also just nice because now, with Alex having it, we technically have another holder. I'm curious to see if Alex will be at our school or if Alex will be gone now. Um, it would be nice for Alex to still show up because, like, Alex deserves to have, you know, friends and time and all that jazz. So I feel, like, slightly bad, but it is nice to have another holder out there. And at least we no longer have that miraculous. Basically, Alex having it means that it's protected now which is like the greatest benefit of having a actual holder. Now Monarch cannot get that Miraculous anymore because Alex is gone. So greatly appreciate that fact. Uh, I will be curious to see because yes, we have three Miraculous to our names, basically, which is kind of intimidating. He has a lot of Miraculous. So I'm very interested to see what will happen and unfold now that he has them and i'm curious to see how quickly we will get some of these miraculous back if we will get some of these miraculous back or if he will just hold on to them because i definitely think we got the most dangerous one back from him but just because we did doesn't mean these other ones are not dangerous um i definitely think like the monkey one is especially intimidating for us I feel like he can very easily come and steal our Miraculous using that one. Um, I think the dragon one is also difficult because he can always just kind of whoosh away. Um, and there's a lot. Uh, the, the horse one is also intimidating. So there's still like a lot of power there. And having the fox one with Mirage is also just definitely beneficial for just like tricking us. So... It'll be interesting to see Monarch and kind of what he does this season. What will happen with everything moving forward. So I'm very, very excited to see what else this season has. Um, I'm going to guess the other episodes probably aren't as crazy as this one. Uh, but it'll be interesting. I, I was not expecting what happened in this episode. Uh, it was, it was wild. So I had a very fun time watching. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching it with me. Uh, it, it was, it was good. It was good. I, I'm in a, I'm in a tizzy though. <laughs> so we'll see what happens. So overall, thank you guys so much for watching this with me. And thank you guys, um, so much for all the support. I'm so glad we're finally caught up the season five. It's kind of crazy to think about. We've been watching Miraculous for almost two years now. Almost. We're not quite at two years, but uh, we're, we're getting close. I think by the time we get maybe through season five, it'll be like the two year mark. So it's been a fun time and it's just cool to finally feel like I'm going to be a part of the fandom because I've kind of had to like close, keep the door closed on the fandom because I didn't want to get spoilers so I feel like now I can kind of start like opening the door. I have been informed though that the entirety of season five's plot line has been leaked, which is like very maddening because I was very excited to start like getting into the fandom and being a part of things just to find out that the fandom sucks. <laughs> like it really sucks. So yeah, we'll see what happens. But overall, thank you guys so much for watching with me. You guys in the fandom are great wow not you guys didn't mean you guys <laughs> but seriously thank you guys so much for watching um please remember uh that it really helps out my channel if you go down to the subscribe button and i want you to use your elbow to hit the subscribe button and when i see a new subscriber pop up i will know that you used your elbow to hit it so 
Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all later.